So here we have the Nissan Qashqai on a 58 plate. So I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some of the controls on the inside of it from there. From the outside you can see it's a five door car with alloy wheels. Let's start off inside the boot uh, first of all. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat, should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back around to the front of the car, and then we'll hop in and run through a few of the controls from there. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter. We have the speedometer on the right-hand side. In the centre, the coolant temperature gauge and fuel gauge, as well as the total miles for this car, which are 148,081. If we back out to the steering wheel, we have phone and stereo controls over on the left-hand side of the steering wheel. And over on the right-hand side, we have the cruise control for the car. In the centre, you'll find the main stereo. So on here, we have AM, FM radio, as you can see. We have a CD player. This car's also got auxiliary input as well. Main volume for the stereo is in the centre just here. You can save radio presets to these numbers here as well. If we press the phone button, we'll then be on the phone menu uh, where you can search and pair a new phone uh, from there. Below that, we have dual zone climate control. You can adjust the driver temperature, the passenger temperature, you can increase and decrease the fan speed. You can determine what direction you'd like the air to be distributed in. The air conditioning is off at the moment. That button turns it on. Or hit auto. The car will now take control of the fan speed and direction of the air to maintain those temperatures for you. Any manual adjustment, your seal auto has now gone off. You can put it back on your own settings there. We also have a 12 volt charging socket here as well. We have the five speed manual gearbox and then deadlock so you can lock and unlock the car doors from the outside. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car for yourself and have a test drive, please feel free to give us a call here at Surrey Specialist Cars. We'd love to hear from you soon.